Can y'all believe they stole our electricity box? It should be right there, but it's not. Hello guys and welcome back to another vlog. I am Miss Dark and Lovely. If you are new to my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. But today we are going to talk about why our electricity box is missing outside. I don't know why somebody decided to take it. Now, we woke up a couple days ago. We said, oh, we're gonna go buy some electricity. We didn't look at the pool outside. We get there, they try to load the money onto the card. But the staff tells us, oh, it's not working. And we're just like, uh, what? But we come home and we go look outside and lo and behold, the box is gone. It is gone. But what I'm trying to understand is somebody decided to commit a crime by stealing the box. But then they decided to make me an accessory to the crime after the fact by hooking up the wires. And with them doing that, I still have electricity. I still got power in the house, but I'm not paying for it. Why? Just why? Why? Somebody explain to me. If you're going to commit your crime, go ahead and do that. But don't set me up to take a fall for what you're doing. Now, I'm not going to lie. Because I've been trying my best to be an upstanding citizen in this great country of mine. I've been minding my business. I don't get into no trouble out here. And you know, it just seems like I can't be left to do that because that's the thing about Ghana. Even when you're trying so hard to follow the laws that nobody really follows and you're trying to do the right thing, somebody can come out of nowhere and just put you in a position to have to be doing wrong. Like this situation right here. I just don't even know what to think of it. I don't know, but one thing I do know after doing some further research, I realized that we're not the only one. Apparently this is a new thing in the neighborhood. A few houses are missing their electricity boxes. And so I couldn't buy electricity and we have to report it to the electricity company of Ghana, their office. So as of now, we are looking into getting a replacement box which I'm sure we're gonna have to pay for. I know somebody's like, why are you complaining? I'm complaining because I don't wanna be in trouble with the law because I'm over here using free electricity. So to whoever stole the box, thank you, but no thanks. I don't wanna be in trouble with the law because somebody decided to steal the box and give us a hookup that we didn't ask for. I'm sure somebody knows whoever's doing this in this area. I know they're going to sell them, so I really hope whoever's doing this will stop before they get caught because I'm almost certain if they catch whoever's doing this, they're not going to spare them. Just put it this way, most of the systems put in place that are meant to serve and protect don't really work. So sometimes the people kind of take things upon themselves. That's how it is. People are, people are tight. People are struggling. People are just ready to defend whatever little bit that they got. Think twice before you try to steal in this country. Oh, Ghana. I'm a Ghana, I don't know. I'm a Ghana. I don't know why you behave like this. But this is part of the reality of living in Ghana. That's all. I just wanted to come in and just throw that at you. As always, guys, thank you for watching. Be kind to yourself, be kind to others. And I will see you in the next Ghana vlog.